Right Honorable Earl C.L. Phantomhive, we've been expecting you. Claude Faustus, the butler of this estate. But of course. Besides, when it comes to spiders, the harder you try to kill them, the faster they cling. I was choosing a costume. You should do the same. Perhaps this one. This is an immaculate room. Everything is perfect, from the neatness of the bedclothes to the placement of the artwork. My master's orders are absolute. You see, I'm one hell of a butler, too. That's why you followed me? Really? Getting cocky because your butler has a little talent, that's a mistake. I have my Claude here. You're not alone. Group attack. Welcome to the fierce raking from hell. Sebastian's amazing. You know, Claude, I think he may be even better than you. We should force him to crawl on his belly like a dog. What do you think? Can you make that happen, Claude? That performance was outstanding. I must say, you have a true talent for music, Sebastian. I cannot accept such praise. I am simply one hell of a butler. Master, I would like to have a word with Claude if it wouldn't trouble you. It shouldn't take terribly long. He can do that, right, Claude? You're nothing if not persistent. You've been hunting my master most relentlessly. My master ordered it. He instructed me to steal C.L. Phantom Hive from Sebastian Michaelis. I cannot abide the thought that someone else has touched him. It's enough to make me sick. The sticky, clinging touch of your vile spiderweb has defiled him. You were right about one thing, though. I most definitely intend to give him a second opportunity to realize his vengeance. But sadly, I'm lacking something crucial. <laughs> you failed me. What shall I do? I'll have to punish you now. Your Highness, you did not order me to kill Sebastian Michaelis. Elizabeth. So, shall we dance? Oh, hello, 